In Bianco Hills, there's a really cool out of bounds glitch you can perform, although there's a bit of setup to get out of the way initially. Firstly, you'll want to get on a lily pad and then maneuver it to this area here and as close to the wall as possible, although this doesn't have to be super exact. Next, you want to lure one of these pond skater enemies over to the lily pad by jumping in the water so that it touches the side of the lily pad. If you now give the pond skater a spray and then ground pound the lily pad, the pond skater will get stuck and now you have to repeatedly ground pound and then spray. Ground pound, spray, ground pound, spray, you get the idea. Doing this will slowly but surely push the lily pad through the wall and in some cases, the pond skater actually follows suit and goes through the wall too. Okay, that's part one of the setup. Part two involves getting Mario out of bounds, which is surprisingly simple, but there's a tiny bit of skill involved. You want to make your way to this area of Bianco Hills, where you begin fighting Petey Piranha in episode 5, Petey Piranha Strikes Back. Just to the right side of and over this fence is a slope that for some reason has no collision, meaning you're able to fall straight through it. Just a small heads up, you may want to perform a spin jump by jumping and rotating the control stick mid-air. You want to spin and then immediately use the hover nozzle and then head in this direction, which should now reunite you with the lily pad we pushed out of bounds. And that is the setup complete. From here, you're able to ride this lily pad all over the place out of bounds because the game doesn't check if the lily pad is actually on water. There are some restrictions though, the amount of water you have being the most obvious. Secondly, a lot of the area out of bounds has death planes below, so you pretty much have to stay on the lily pad. You can, however, venture through walls and you can end up in some weird situations where Mario's head pokes through the ground as you glide along. You can even go all the way around Bianco Hills to get great views like this, but if you're thinking, oh wow, I want to go to Delfino Plaza, sad news for you I'm afraid. If you go too far out of bounds, the game straight up kills Mario, which honestly sucks. Also, when you get out here, if you jump off the lily pad, Mario actually gets stuck in the air. You can use Flood, but you're unable to aim, so yay? Funniest thing is though, if you press B, Mario will end up in a weird contorted pose where Flood is disjointed and now you're really stuck. Soft locked in fact. Time to reset. This is a really neat glitch honestly and there's a lot going on here, so have fun trying it out.